This part is going to be braided, so I'm going to make another line. Hi. <laughs> Come say hi to the camera. <laughs> say hi to my awkward boyfriend. I'm not used to being in front of the camera. <laughs> if you guys haven't seen the video that was the one video that we've done, um, I will put a link right here it's a boy my boyfriend does my natural hair and it's super funny he's so awkward in front of the camera <laughs> I mean I am too but I mean whatever it's really funny so you guys should watch it we've actually been thinking about doing more videos if you guys want to see more videos with my boyfriend in it leave a comment down below and I will definitely make sure to do that Okay, now that I've finished this part, I'm going to braid this part and I'm going to use my Eco Styler Gel and I'm using a different one this time. I'm using the green one, which I actually like the green one better. I don't really know, honestly. I can't really tell much of a difference with them, but I feel like the green one is like the OG one that everybody always goes to and I like to add it to like the front part. Before you braid your hair, I would advise for you to comb it out because it's a lot harder when you try to braid your hair. And I learned the hard way because I just tried to braid it without combing it out. And yeah, it wasn't working out for me. And now once you finish, you're just gonna tie the bottom. Okay. So it'll look like this, and then 
I'm going to make another part on the other side. Gel and braid it. And next, you can get a little bit of gel and smooth out the top of your hair. Grab this braid and wrap it around. Wrap it around like this. And then bobby pin it in the back. And then do the same thing on this side. So you can leave it like this, or to add a little twist, you can take this little chunk of hair, braid this section as well. Alright, so now that you have this braid right here, you're going to do the same thing on this side. So then you're going to have these two braids, like that, and like that, and then you're going to kind of like loosen the braids a little bit, as much as you can. Then you're going to braids like this. I'm gonna kind of like loosely like so it has like a little loop. Just loosely pin it to the back where so it could connect and meet with the other braids. Do the same thing on this side. Tuck them like that so it look like that. And there you go. That's how it will look at the top. So, okay so now I'm just gonna fix this part and I'm just gonna wet this part really quick and I'll be right back okay I am back with wet hair now I'm going to use this this right here it's not a leave-in conditioner but I still use it as a leave-in conditioner because it really really moisturizes my hair really well and I've been doing it for a long time and my hair's been fine so yeah, so I'm just going to rub that through my hair. Of course, I have to go in with some, well, some gel. And this is what I always use. And I love this stuff. You see, I have a whole bottle of it. And I got this off of Amazon. That's where you will find the bigger bottles. And I'm just gonna put some, and I like to start off with the bottoms of my hair. Cause I really like the ends, my ends to be the most like defined. But yeah, so I just go in with that. And then I like to just finger curl the ends. I feel like if I like focus on finger curling it, it kind of makes it more defined and it keeps that little curl. It doesn't get like really frizzy. And it also kind of stretches out the bottom of my curls. I also like to focus on putting the gel in this part, this under part of my hair because this is where my hair is definitely the kinkiest. Okay, so now I'm gonna do the last step. And of course I gotta, you know, touch up the baby hairs real quick. And first, before I use the, the toothbrush to do, I like to just go in and kind of naturally try to pull them out. If I put some gel, I put a little bit of gel, I dip it a little bit in here. And I usually have the brush. The brush is usually wet. Okay, I'm gonna go in and work with my baby hairs. I do the technique before I put the gel on. It kind of already lays my baby hairs in the way that it would look already but if I didn't manipulate it, if that makes sense. But yeah, then this is what you have. Alright, so I hope you all enjoyed that video. It was kind of, I feel like I have something in my eye. But yeah, it was kind of different than what I'm used to doing. I'm talking a lot more in this video, so hopefully you enjoyed that. I just wanted to actually film a real-time video. This is really how I'm going to be wearing my hair out for today. So I actually have to go. I'm just going to be going out, going to the mall. I really like how this turned out. I hope you guys tried this really cute hairstyle out as well. It's it's so simple and it's very cute. So yeah, so thank you. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to click the bell because you don't want to miss my upcoming video.